Hello everyone, Long here. And ha first off, I just want to say happy day to you, happy week. Uh, it is the weekend, so I thought I'd go ahead and check out, find time to like check out a game that has been on my radar for a while now. Diplomacy is not an option, so I haven't had a chance to. I'm actually gonna go in blind on this, but I thought I, uh, but it looked kind of interesting just from the box art. So if I were to go to the art on the game while this game is loading up. Indeed. Uh, let's take a look here. So, uh, what is diplomacy is not an option. Okay. It, uh, all right. Diplomacy is not an option. Uh, okay. So let's take a look at the uh, settings first off. Uh, language, English, and I don't know if that would be a French, uh, German, which, uh, or German, uh, Italian. I'm actually starting to learn Italian. Uh, uh, Spanish, I do know. Uh, I don't know these other languages. I think that one's true. So let's go with English. Uh, I'm gonna say auto save in five minute intervals. Interesting. I don't know why they had to have it like an auto save interval here. Um, so, but that's okay. All right, I'm curious now. I'm genuinely curious as to how this game is going. Uh, control tips, yep, that's fine. Health bar, sure. Diplomacy is not an option. It is not an option. Alright, cool. Well, let's go with it. Uh, I'll call myself Long. Okay. Okay, so th this is the, uh, the open menu here. Uh, there are several ones. Uh, there's a challenge card. In order to avoid psychological trauma from seeking a PC, I highly recommend you click the Yeah, send me a little Take me there. All right, let's see what this game is all about. No expectations going in completely blind. Uh, so... Uh, but it looks to be some kind of a strategy game which does auto saves every five minutes. Kind of interesting. Complete all the tasks to end tutorial. Okay. All right, let's just go ahead and go through it. All right, let me take some time to move my camera so it's much more visible here. And then, okay. Uh, and another thing I want to do, options. Do they have anything for graphic video? Yes, they do. Borderless window. Okay, so now that I can actually switch. Um, uh, turn. All right. Borderless is what I was going for. Otherwise, I have to continually do shift tab on the controller. Scroll, mouse wheel. Okay. Mouse wheel, move your mouse to rotate the camera. Or you can use page up, page down, Q and E. Show your troops, highlight them so it's a little closer. Oh, yeah! You're under attack. Huh? What are they doing hanging out there? They're just hanging out there, huh? not doing anything. For all the attackers. They weren't doing anything. They're just kind of standing there. Okay. Yeah, so that one had a little damage. Okay. Avoid cramming, we're gonna need food production. Uh, berry pickers, house will do. Okay. Alright, so we click up here. So we want to build a berry picker. I'll get my troops together, like so. A fisherman's hut near the pond. There you go. Yep, understood. Appreciate all the explanation. Okay. Once I get more, I think. I think a better place to move my camera is probably uh, 
top right corner, I think. Seems that they've spilled a lot of the milk. Doesn't seem like there's really much in the way of a, you know, limitations of where to build. But I'll just put them geographically. In the geographically makes sense. All right, cool. Take a look at all the. Oh, nice fish. Fish look pretty well animated here. Yeah, I like the detail. I like that they are putting in effort to actually do some cool things. Now that's a Barry Picker's house, but what are they doing bringing it all the way over there when there's a typical sign here? Okay. You can set it just look replace the flag. Change the working region. Okay. And Our people are under attack. Seeing someone die. What the heck? Uh, bodies of your troops and citizens uh, lying around the settlement will spread the disease. Somebody has to bury the dead somewhere. Okay. Alright, Dave Digger's house. Okay. Nope, that's that's a Grave Digger's house. Let's put the Oh shit. And then cemetery. Looks like I have to build a cemetery too. Uh let's build it away from There you go. Aw, what a shame. Every morning, new people come to your settlement if there's a room for them. Build a couple of houses. All right, no worries. So let's build close to home. So far, the only thing that's kind of missing is that there's a speed up uh, control, but I think that should be fine. I don't think these are houses. That's a build it. These are builder's houses. Oops. My bad. Made a little boo-boo here. That's okay. All right. Uh, tell you what. I'm going to build a house right here. And another one. Reasonably close to the town hall. Yeah. I think at building the houses uh, actually add more. What maybe? I don't know. We'll find out. Building two. Avoid building side by side, especially for those buildings that require pretty work is extra for building. On auto repair mode. Research also allows you to improve the economic and military life of your settlement. Some research is unlocked after you construct or improve certain buildings. Open the research window and start any available research. No available research here. Greenery is So I'll go barracks. 
just didn't get research going to start in. What else can... Yeah. Oh, here you go. Comfortable shoes. That's good stuff. Spreading your settlement to deal with the build a hospital. Oh, yeah. Royal. The enemy will attack you in waves. The settlement you're surrounded by enemy camps usually have to repel several attacking waves of wind. You can see how the new map within the nearest wave is coming from. Ooh, yeah. Huh? Okay. You need to raise your military higher <laughs> Research complete. Our units are in combat. What a tower. Unbelievable. One thirty two. Huh?
Huh? What now? I'm here. Hmm? Moving. Forces are approaching. are under attack. Easy enough. Cool. Alright. The toil is finished. Enemies killed. 31. Diplomacy not in motion. Cool. Popcorn Difficulty uh, selection here. Uh, challenges. The pulse all in it. Sure, let's go through it. See how this does. Okay, good with popcorn and beer. Yes, show mission objectives. All right, cool. First things first, gotta set up some, gotta get a place to eat. Mm, nothing suitable, mind you. Definitely, we have to have one. Gotta have some lumber. I've been sitting here for a lumber mill. Maybe it'll be close by. Also, a stone mine. Huh? 
should operate in radius. Calculations of private dimension generated with support for calculation. And so oh, yeah. we have operations going there. down here. Probably sure. best to set up. Sure. Yeah, what else? I think we are watching forces. Ah? Uh? Royo. Sure. Setting up auto repair. And uh, I'm going to set up here. Right here. Our troops are under attack. Oh, yeah. Sure. Huh? Oh. Royal. Samaras. Do me best. Okay. There. Okay.
Hey. Okay. Hey. Sure. Oh, yeah. Enemy forces are approaching. Huh? Oh, Arm here. Huh? What now? Hmm? Oh, yeah. Huh? Four, eh? Arm here. Let's go. One casualty. Okay, I uh, need another house.
probably I'm going to need a second. What now? Hmm? Let's go. You're the Lord. Moving. Here we go. Let's go. I like this bit. All right. I'll have them. You're the Lord. Let's go. Moving. You're the Lord. Yeah, All right. Basically, like. Just relaxing and chill. Nothing wrong with that. Let's go. Moving. All right. You're the Lord. All right. They are attacking our buildings. Seven days and then they'll attack us. They will send out to for their onslaught. They'll be attacking from the west. I need to go around.
Sometimes this can be a little weird. Sometimes you'll have to micromanage your, like, uh, you'll have to micromanage things such as, you know, how many workers you can have allocated. Yeah, this whole idea of, like, micromanaging people like this, I'm sure it was a design by... It can get tedious, but I guess you'll eventually get used to it. I'm gonna need a couple more builder houses. Sometimes that's what I'm kind of a little upset about right now. I can barely do. Yeah, I feel like I feel very constrained to the, the number of workers. I don't know Enemy forces are approaching. What now? Let's go. Moving. Your the Lord. I wonder how they're gonna attack here. Hmm. All right. This is so weird. Sometimes. Let's go. Moving. Your the oh, Lord. Oh snap! Here they come. I like this bit. It takes a long time just to play through. And all my kids are there, right? But I'm a lot of people. Great. Alright, I'm gonna quit. Yep. Dang it. That sucks. Alright, um, so ladies and gentlemen, uh, that was quite interesting. That was, uh, my. That was Diplomacy is not an option. Done all right, game. I mean, like, uh, yeah. If I look at the Steam reviews, I think I'm gonna. It's. Uh, I think it's gonna take a while for me to kind of get used to. It, but uh, I'm not deterred from the uh, challenge per se. I'm just kind of like, dang, 
I I just had a dumb brain, again, an idiot brain uh, about me. I think like one of my problems was like I just anticipated things a little too. I I thought too far ahead instead of like um, I was paying more attention to what was uh, open and what was covered by trees. Apparently. They will go through the trees. So I didn't know about that, but yeah, I I think overall this is actually a pretty dang good game. So um, for me, it's just that I had uh, not even thought about that possibility of like um, of uh, enemy troops going through um, going through. So yeah. Anyway, the game is available on early access. I'm going to link you to the uh, all the relevant links. Like here's the Steam page here. It's available for early access, but I want to say thank you to the developers for offering me the opportunity to uh, to share uh, my gameplay of, um, you know, like for diplomacy is not an option. I think there's a lot to, uh, I think this game ultimately has a lot of potential. And so I'm going to go ahead and like, uh, yeah, I'll, re I'll definitely recommend it. Um, yeah, check it out when you can. Uh, seems like pretty solid bunch here, Door 407. Yeah, they also released one of the game called Urbo. Um, don't know what that is, but yeah, overall, not bad. All right, that's it for me, everyone. Uh, thank you very much for uh, watching my video. If you enjoyed it, please do like the vid, comment on what you enjoyed, what you didn't enjoy. If you want to see more awesome, uh, more content like this, please do uh, subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. All right, thank you very much, everyone. Hang loose.